today is October the 31st, and it is, I believe, like 9 or 10 o'clock at night. Uh, we're really getting close to, you know, zero hour here with, uh, with No Shave November starting, so I think it's time really to dive in and shave, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna take I'm gonna take it here and, uh, and start the uh, start the process. Um, show your beard, grow your beard, take a picture every day. You know, I, I think this is a great opportunity for me to shave for one. You know, make my parents happy a little bit maybe. I I don't know. And then also, I, I guess uh, you know grow my beard back out, maybe maybe a little fuller, because uh, I, I think if you shave, you're supposed to grow back a little fuller. I don't know. Um, I don't know how fast it will grow back in. I know I can't compete with, uh, with those three beards, because, I mean, after a while, I think, uh, I think remembering last year, watching it on, um, watching it on Whiskerino, they became almost mongrel. I mean, just feral beards that were just bam, huge. Uh, I, I don't think I can achieve that, but I'm, I'm going to say the hell with it and I'm going to try. Uh, I think that's that's the most important thing here. I think it's it's really trying and honing in on my, my own inner vanity and you know, becoming the subject of a photograph that I'm taking every single day and you know, I think it'll be a great, great little project, really, to work on my beard. Um, I, I don't know what else there is really to say. Like, I, I started, I started, I, I got this, this email from, from Justin and, uh, or XJ Dunn, um, on, on, on Facebook, and he's going, hey man, you should, you should check this out, and I'm going, man. I'm, I'm in college, you know, the beard is, the beard, there's a lot of people here that, that, that have beards, and it's cool, you know, and, and the people here that don't have beards, they really, they, they can't grow them yet, because they just, they've got such juvenile faces that just won't push out that manly hair, and I, I just really think that, you know, the beard here is, is status and power, and I, I, I was really apprehensive at first to start the shaving process, you know, to really, I, I was thinking, no, I can't, I can't do it, you know, I don't want to go through looking like I'm 12 again, you know, but then I thought, you know, hey, there are so many people that are, that are here that, that they look like they're 12 too, and, heck, it's college, who, who cares, I'm never going to see these people again. But, uh, I mean, really, I, I think that, I think that it's time to, to shave. You know, but, but uh, I, was, I was really apprehensive at first, you know. I was thinking, man, people are gonna not, not going to recognize me. Some of these people that I've, that I've known for a while, some of these people I've only known with a beard. What are they going to think? Like, you know, is my face going to be fatter? You know, is it going to be expanded? Am I going to look chubbier? Am I going to look thinner? I don't know. I have no honest-to-God idea. And, uh... I, it just, it kind of scares me. I'm a little freaked out, thinking, you know, what am I going to do? But uh, in reality, um, I think it'll be a good thing. I think it'll open my mind up a little bit more. I seem to have cut myself. It's a problem with only having shaved in this area, you know, never with one of these. I seem to have cut myself in several locations. Son of a bitch. Well, the problem with the face is, it just keeps bleeding. I can't seem to stop it. But I do rather enjoy this look. Yeah, quite so. Um, heck, it might make me look a little bit more professional. For a while, I, I 
I will. I, I am planning on taking this project on to its fullest extent and going ahead and doing my photos and everything. And I, I'm not planning on shaving until I think the date's like February when we can start trimming it up, like February or one. Like, you know, that's that's a good uh, what five months there of, of growing a beard and just. I'm not gonna have a massive beard, unfortunately, but uh, I think I'll have a a young hipster. Ah, I hate hipsters. I think I'll have a young, you know, trying beard that that's out there kicking new age ass. And uh, I mean, I've I've always been partial to the beard. I, I've always been partial to facial hair. Uh, I think the Victorians had it right in you know, that facial hair was, was totally in, um, and it was totally stylable. Um, I love the chat mentality of life where, you know, one's mustache must be utterly incredible. Um, and I think that this contest, it's not really a contest, I think that this, I think that this is really going to give me a chance to dive in and try something new. I'm really looking forward to this, and I hope you guys, uh, hope you guys stay tuned on to the Cincinnati Beard Growing Community's Facebook page, as well as, uh, you know, my Facebook page for my profile picture updates daily, probably, um, as well as my, uh, my Flickr account. So, in conclusion, um... I am bleeding very badly from my face. Uh, I am starting to wonder whether or not this was a good idea. Uh, I have applied septic pencils to close the arteries, uh, and I have applied um, aftershave bump guard, um, and it's really burning right now. Uh, overall, I don't know, I feel very different, I look very different. Um, it's not bad. Uh, I do look much younger. My face does look much fatter. I'm not happy about that, but I'll get over it. Get over it. Um, it is very much colder right now. I did not realize how much my beard insulated my face. Uh, I am glad to say that the end game is to grow my said beard back. Uh, that makes me very happy. Um, but. Overall, I can't really complain. Uh, I look forward to engaging in this competition. Take it easy, guys.